will remind you of the six million Jews that were killed. There was massacre every year. They're reminding you so that it cannot be repeated. It's not that they want to go after you or the person, this and that. Can you imagine the amount of us that came through the Atlantic slave trade? We have to also remind people that slavery is not a good thing. Mm -hmm. So since this is a, it's fresh and there's a possibility it might be repeated, we need to make sure that it doesn't happen again. So we would go on our teleconference and decide where we'll have it again. And those of you who are here, and my, my, my first time meeting my my uh, nep my nephew's uh, uh, wife. I read about you a lot. I, I have all your pictures. <laughs> she always sent it to me. <laughs> Meeting you. So let us make this an annual celebration. We will go on the internet and ask some of our brothers and sisters, you know, where who will host it. Because if we made a decision now, they will blame Baba. They will blame. Um, Twan, they will blame me, mm -hmm. and this is our new man. He did not, they may attack him. They will blame us. So we will go and put it over there. If anybody wants to carry it, and say, well, if it will happen in Atlanta, it will happen uh, in Boston, it will happen. Then we will decide and communicate with you guys that we do that. It is very essential, you know, for us to do these things. And look at the point that uh, he read. It was very touching, and, and he writes poetry too. I have two books of poems that I will be uh, be re, uh, uh, write, uh, publishing. So all of these things, so so that we can celebrate. You know, we we'll celebrate. We are not pushing blame on other people, as they said. Oh, it's political. You will make the president look bad, and they said, we'll make the president look bad because I'm my grandmother. Has no grave today. She was about 80 some years of age when the war was going on, this and that. She just walked out of the house. Yeah. She has no grave. My uncle, my father, little brother, the two of them, he was he married to a crown woman. Crew married to a crown woman in Chen. Today, we don't know what happened to him. Mm. He has no grave. So, to memorize these people, I think it means a lot to us. So, mm -hmm. we also thank all of you for coming. And uh, it's not the amount of people that gather, it's the, the quality and the passion mm -hmm. with which the people that you have together that what makes the difference. And the message was well re received. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll make use of it on our website. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I would like to thank Pastor John. Message. Yeah. Uh, this organization, actually, you know, I don't want to go into sack. Like, one point she strike, you know, that really, you know, touched me was getting maybe our kids involved because mm -hmm. all of us here we get you know packages of experience mm -hmm. we could bring forth and explain you know whereby you know it'll just be like going in cycle here and there but in order somebody once said in order to have the ability of precognition we should have the ability of postcognition you know far versa in order to understand what happened in the past we do we are older now our kids, we have to because, trust me, you know, the, uh, the Liberian community have been polarized. And because of the polarization, some of our kids will even be injected with those phases mm -hmm. of division mm -hmm. as they grow, mm -hmm. you know. So in uh, uh, this, I mean, I pledge my fullest support, you know. I have been reading about, you know, the back and forth on this whole thing. And sometimes when I see that, I say, wow. It's Liberia, you know, Liberia as a country and Liberians as people. We have been 
so polar to the extent I thought, you know, uh, uh, there's a spell cast on most of the librarians. There is a spell, yeah, and it takes, you know, very few person like all the commercial, yeah, few people to lead the way, you know, to make sure that certain things are understood the way they are. Yeah, TRC took, uh, you know, the, the charge to investigate, taxpayer monies were invested in those things, they trashed the report. Everything in Liberia nowadays is politics, you know. Politics is, as a student of politics, I believe that politics are conflict over public policies. The structure and processes designed to manage them is just what makes sense. Your idea, my idea. But if somebody becomes unreasonable, mm -hmm. unreasonable again become relative, you know, mm -hmm. in terms of the school of thought you form. You see? So I pledge my support and I'll get you guys contact, you know, to make sure that we sustain this. When he said this should be an annual thing, you know, because I wonder if the last pieces that I wrote, you know, when the Grand Jury Association came, you know, making contradictory remarks, uh, the person that came up with that piece, you know, yeah, uh, telling you guys, thank you very much for organizing this. And mm -hmm. I said, by all means, I will have to be over there. And I talked to my fiance, I said, look, we have to go. And so we are here, I pledge my support, we sustain this movement, you know, mm -hmm. to make sure that things are done, of course, again, properly will be relative, but again, mm -hmm. yeah, we just have to maintain. Work our, together. Yeah, yeah work together and what I So I thank you all, and let the good old law, you know, strengthen our resolve Amen. to pursue this struggle. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.